In this video, I'm going to be showing how you can fix broken connections between your nodes in your graphs when you're using visual scripting. So right here, I have a graph that just has two nodes connected. And then also I have the same exact one, but this time I used an embedded one. One reason why you might have those graphs disconnected is if you remove the package. So for instance, if you want to reimport the package and update to a newer one, uh, what you might do is remove this package. I'm going to show this with my Spock package. So I'm going to remove all the graphs that are in that package. And now if we open the graph, you can see that you know, we have errors here. It doesn't know which subgraphs we're talking about. So let's go ahead and import Spock back in here. So all of our units, let's import those in. Okay, the import is done, but whenever you do import of any packages that contain visual scripting, be sure to go to project settings and under visual scripting click generate that way you trigger a visual scripting to go through what you just imported and create a, a list of those graphs okay that is done but if we go to the graph again we'll still find those errors so and we can check the embedded one as well so same thing we got errors so what you want to do next is turn off unity and relaunch the project so let's go ahead and do that so my project started up again and we can go and look at those graphs and there you go we have the graphs connected again and the settings were saved as well so the configurations that we had for those units were were saved and let's check the embedded and same thing here so that is how you fix those graphs whenever you need to remove the package and add that back in if you found this video helpful click on that like button and i'll see you in the next one